now to an important recall alert from Stu Leonard's that has already had deadly consequences. The grocery store says a man died after eating their vanilla Florentine cookies. Now the problem is that the cookies contain peanuts, but there is no mention of that on the ingredient label. And that proved to be fatal for a man in his 20s who ate one at a party and later died from an allergic reaction. I want to reporter Marcus Solis is live in Danbury with much more. Marcus. Well, listen, Dave, those vanilla Florentines are only sold during the holidays. And this year, the recipe was changed from but soy nuts to peanuts. Stu Leonard says that change was made without their knowledge, but the manufacturer of the cookie says that's just not true. There were roughly 500 packages of Florentine cookies sold during the holidays at Stu Leonard's, but the lack of one single word on the packaging is being linked to the death of a person who suffered an allergic reaction. The missing ingredient, peanuts. I could imagine how that family feels right now. And, you know, we're all just very, very sad about this whole thing. Stu Leonard Jr. issued a video statement following the death of a person identified only as a New Yorker in their 20s who ate the cookie at a social gathering. The Florentines were manufactured by Cookies United on Long Island and repackaged by Stu Leonard's, which claims it was unaware they now contained peanuts. The supplier changed the recipe and started going from soy nuts to peanuts, and our chief safety officer here at Stu Leonard's was never notified. But Cookies United says it can prove otherwise. An email dated July 11th plainly states the cookies now contain peanuts. The company listing the redacted email addresses of 11 Stu Leonard's employees who were notified of the change. The supplier also providing a picture of its labeling that lists peanuts as an ingredient. The holiday cookies were only sold in the Danbury and Newington locations between November 6th and December 31st, with a Best Buy date of January 5th. Stu's a they're pretty on the ball. They usually, you know, up to date with you know all their products. So I was kind of surprised. Again, these cookies only sold during the holidays, and the Best Buy date is a few weeks in the past. So it's unlikely there are very many of these cookies still around. But anyone with a nut allergy is obviously encouraged to return them to the store for a full refund.